Hi guys. Welcome to my channel. Before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel. 10 most bizarre fairground attractions. So make sure to watch the full video. Not simply children can enjoy fairgrounds. For the enjoyment of visitors of all ages, contemporary theme parks offer performances, attractions, thrilling rides, and interactive experiences. A trip to any of the 10 parks listed below will satisfy the thrill seeker in every group because they each have the world's most exhilarating rides and attractions. 10 City of Dordrecht is home to the Ark of Noah. Evan Almighty is a cheesy comedy film in which a contemporary guy constructs an ark in the same manner as Noah. Don't bother watching it. However, a movie about a real-life contemporary man who built an ark akin to Noah's in the Netherlands, a nation that is actually prone to flooding, would have been much more compelling. In 1992, a dream about a massive flood gave Johan Hybers the idea to construct an ark. Before beginning work on a replica made to Noah's, reputed, original dimensions, 30 meters wide, 23 meters high, and 135 meters long, he first opened a smaller model in 2007 that was still respectably 70 meters long. In addition to housing a variety of animals, such as rabbits, horses, and kangaroos, this facility first opened to the public in 2012 and features exhibitions about Noah. 9 Forevertron by Dr. Evermore, Sumter, Wisconsin, USA. Since 1983, Tom Every, also known as Dr. Evermore, a former industrial wrecker from Wisconsin, has been constructing fantastical objects out of leftover scrap metal. Every claims that his alternate personality, Dr. Evermore, is a Victorian professor from Eggington, Bedfordshire, England, who was motivated to construct a spacecraft after witnessing a powerful lightning storm. The 300-ton sculpture known as the Forevertron, which has a glass capsule for Dr. Evermore to sit in when he eventually returns to space, comes into play in this situation. In addition to the Forevertron, there are other devices to investigate, such as the Graviton and the Celestial Listening Ears, which include artwork and artifacts from industrial-era factories and power plants. One of the most noteworthy pieces of scrap that Dr. Evermore helped give new life to was the decontamination chamber from the Apollo space mission. 8. Italy's Montello has Ipiapi Playgrounds Ipiapis is an impressive, albeit slightly unsettling, proposal as far as DIY theme parks are concerned. The homemade amusement park in northern Italy is hidden behind a family restaurant in a wooded location. The restaurant's owner, Bruno, launched it in 1969, and over the subsequent four decades, he welded together the most elaborate after-dinner entertainment venture imaginable. The playground, which is everything from slides to kinetic roller coasters, is open to all patrons of the restaurant though it's definitely wise to finish some of that meal before you ride. Ipiapi.com 7 Labyrinth of Josep Pujula, Argelager, Spain Josep Pujula built a sizable handmade maze next to the Fluvia River in Argelager, Catalonia, which is eerily beautiful, albeit occasionally terrifying. The textile worker started creating it in 1980 but had to destroy it in 2002 to make room for a highway. Visitors can now stroll along tubed walkways created from a woven lattice consisting of concrete, recycled materials, stone, and wood thanks to Pujula's unfazed reconstruction of his work on a neighboring area. Its existence was contested with the authorities up until October 2014, when they eventually decided to grant it local heritage status. Today, it is a nominee for the 2015 International Award for Public Art. 6 Coral Castle, Homestead, Florida, United States Coral Castle is a naive early 20th century structure that was constructed in 1920 by Edward Leeds Kalman, who Wikipedia describes as a Latvian-American onball. Not the luckiest man. Leeds Kalman fled to the States after his 16-year-old fiancé dumped him. He was immediately infected with TB upon arrival, but he recovered and started erecting a fortress out of coral limestone blocks. Before passing away in 1951, he spent 28 years creating it, citing his sweet 16 as the source of inspiration. At that period, he meticulously cut 1,100 tons of stone to make walls, furnishings, and a castle tower. An 8-foot, eight 8-ton, eight rotating stone gate that was perfectly balanced on its axis and could be moved with just one finger was one of the most astounding engineering feats ever. Billy Idol's song Sweet 16, an ode to the castle, was inspired by the enigmatic endeavor. 5 Dalat, Vietnam, The Crazy House the Crazy House, which resembles a melted cheese grater, is a magnificent building that has been compared to Sesame Street by its website. Dang Viet Nga, an architect, designed the house, but he didn't utilize conventional blueprints, instead, he created it out of paintings. The ten guest rooms in the five-story building are each styled after an animal, and the hallways are designed to imitate tunnels. 
Unfortunately for Nga, who accumulated debts in order to purchase her ideal home, the house has grown to be a well-liked tourist destination since she first allowed guests into it in 1990. Crazyhouse.vn has rooms starting at 25 US dollars per night. 4 Brankston, Northumberland, UK, Cement Menagerie. This remarkable garden, packed with vibrantly painted handmade animal sculptures, has a touching backstory, and a few humans. The garden was created by John Farnington, a retired master joiner who was actually 80 when he began construction, and his wife Mary for the amusement of their at-home cared for son who was crippled. The garden contains over 300 statues that were constructed in the 1960s using concrete and chicken wire, including zebras, rhinos, and crocodiles. The garden is now maintained by the family who designed it, even though they passed away. 3 Wat Lan Co in the Thai province of Sisaket. This temple to the carbonated beverage at the Thai-Cambodia border is made of 1.5 million beer bottles and is brown and emerald in color. The temple was created by a group of monks when they started asking villagers to bring their empty Chang and Heinekens to them, though, for the record, they had nothing to do with emptying the bottles. The bottles were used to construct a complex that the monks are now expanding, using the tops to make mosaics inside the temple. The more bottles we obtain, the more buildings we construct, according to Abbot San Catabunio. 2 Bishop Castle, Colorado, United States. A chimney on the castle that Jim Bishop, 57, has been building for more than 30 years, is added by lifting boulders onto a homemade pulley lift. To add to a chimney on the castle, Jim Bishop raises stone to load onto a homemade pulley lift. Picture courtesy of Glenn Asakawa slash Denver Post via Getty Images. The English instructor who yelled at Jim Bishop, you'll never amount to anything, has undoubtedly been proven wrong. A little piece of land in Colorado's San Isabel National Forest was purchased by the high school dropout's parents after he successfully persuaded them to do so. Bishop started constructing a one-room stone cottage 10 years later, when he was married and 25 years old. That was in 1969. The area has since been transformed into the location of an impressive handcrafted castle with turrets and a fire-breathing dragon installed on one of the chimneys. Even today, work is still being done on the 160-foot tall stone and iron wonder. What a mysterious floating wonderland. Freedom Cove is an art piece that serves as a display for alternative sustainable living. It is a hidden, floating fantasy. The collection of houseboats was founded in 1992 and is sometimes referred to as Wayne and Catherine's Gardens, after the artist couple who reside there and designed it. The location, which is nearly an island in and of itself, is made up of 12 floating platforms, 5 greenhouses, a studio, and a gallery. The people who live there eat the vegetables that are grown there as well as fish that are caught in the nearby inlet. Via kayak or charter boat excursion, visitors can travel to Freedom Cover in Cypress Bay. So, that's it for today. We hope you enjoyed the video. Use the comment section below to tell us what you think about the video. Also, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click the bell button to be notified of all the latest videos.